Welcome to Electric World TV for another instalment of Fan Splaining. Today we ask, what is positive input ventilation? Positive input ventilation or PIV systems have been around for decades and largely only used to treat condensation and mould issues. However, in recent times, PIV has seen a resurgence in both domestic and commercial settings as the need for clean, fresh air has become more important than ever, as well as economical ways to keep indoor spaces fresh and healthy. So how does it work? Positive input ventilation creates a healthy home by circulating fresh, filtered air into a house, forcing stale air out of the natural gaps in the fabric of the building or through trickle vents. PIV systems filter the incoming air, removing any particles such as pollen, and then gently releases the fresh air through a vent throughout your home at a constant rate to create a supply of continual positive pressure, resulting in the air in the property being continually diluted, displaced, and replaced to create a healthier indoor air quality. Most units will also include a heater which warms the incoming air, stopping cold drafts during colder periods and can be bypassed during summer months. There are two types of PIV units. The first is installed in the loft area and ducts through a diffuser mounted in the ceiling of the hall or landing below. The second is a compact wall mounted version which is designed for use in flats and apartments with no loft space. Here are some of the benefits of a PIV system. Helps to alleviate condensation, damp and mould supplies clean, fresh air, reduces household allergens, low maintenance, and available in loft or wall-mounted versions. Most importantly, PIV units are a very cost-effective way of keeping your whole house well ventilated without losing the warmth generated by your central heating during colder months. Something we can all agree is an important consideration at the moment. Check out the range of PIV units available at extractorfanworld.co.uk part of the Electric World family.